Thanks, Dave. Stop. Of course, one of the great things about social media is that it's two-way. So I walk out the door and love this, which I'm going to. It'll be up on social media within seconds. Why is marketing important to many businesses? I think marketing is really important to any business because one, it helps um, build the brand's awareness, it helps attract customers, and really uh, importantly, build brand loyalty. I think one of the key things that um, businesses need to consider is they need to know who their customer base is or their target market, and what is the right message for that target market, and, and that can really be effective on any budget. We would all love to have the budgets of Pepsi and Coke and um, McDonald's, um, but we can't. Um, but that's not to say that you can have a really effective market marketing campaign um, that attracts the right customers to your business. Okay, now before you were mentioning Coca-Cola, McDonald's, etc., they spend millions and millions of dollars on marketing. Does it have to be that expensive when it comes to, for instance, social media? No, I mean, one of the benefits of social media and the, I guess the growth of that particular platform is the cost-effective nature of it. Customers are interacting with social media, whether it's Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, um, Pinterest, on a daily basis, where we're avid consumers of social media. Um, so even just playing in that space for businesses is so important to connecting people in, in an environment where they actually want to receive that information. We don't all read the newspaper, we don't all watch the television news. So connecting with people where they want to play is one of the key areas where people can actually get that penetration. Do you think social media is good for your business? For my business, definitely. I think it's essential. We use the social media forums, Facebook, Instagram. They're linked, so all you have to do is post something on one of the social forums and it sort of links it to the other. It's almost as good as just advertising out on the street because everyone's got it right there. They just look at it and I think it's important yeah, differently. You had a great idea when you first took the shop over in relation to social media. Tell us yeah. about that. So the idea I had was uh, you can actually go to certain areas on your social forum and type in a location and it just gives you a list of people in that location. So we typed in Varsity Lakes is where we are and we just followed thousands and thousands of people in the area before we even had it opened and maybe only half of them follow back. But just the fact that once they start following you back, your information or whatever you're plugging onto the social forum from your end comes up on their feed. We can actually physically see the result of people coming through, having a laugh with us and saying, hey, like we might tell a random joke or have a quiz on there. First one to answer this riddle and you get a free upgrade or something like that. And then we have people in the drive through saying, oh, we know the riddle code and you've got to keep it always positive. So Facebook really is a community, but in that there are dangers, are there not, in having an open forum? That's right. I mean, one of the key things about Facebook is building an online community. You're building um, a fan base, basically, for your brand. Uh, loyal customers, you know, potential customers who still want to connect with your brand. But there are some dangers. I mean, it is an open platform. And one of the recommendations uh, we always make to our clients is that you have to be open and transparent. You can't simply use it as an advertising platform. You have to accept the good and the bad, but it's how you manage um, that communication in that platform that makes it most effective. Okay, so I'm starting my business today and I'm starting my Facebook page. What's your best tip for me? Two tips, and one is to be prepared. Um, it's a full-time job, so to speak. You have to dedicate that time. And secondly, is be really planned with your content. Have a content management um, strategy in place and plan your content for the month in advance.